mean, there's a lot that I do to keep my appearance up. I mean, but I never see my husband like worry about it. If there was one thing I could change regarding women's lives today, it would be to stop the shame that women feel about their bodies, whether it's about menstrual cycles or abortion or going through menopause. So who influenced me the most about what it meant to be a woman or a girl in the world was probably my mom. As a little girl, observing her uh, looking in, in a mirror and always finding fault with herself, whether, you know, her, her, her eyes, her wrinkles, her fat stomach, or, or whatever. She never found anything good, she only found fault. Do I think my age has anything to do with how I'm perceived? I, sadly, I would say yes. What would happen if women ruled the world? What would the first day of the matriarchy look like? Hi, my name is Kimberly Dillon, and I'm the writer, producer, and director of the short film One Day, where a woman wakes up and she finds herself in a whole new female paradigm. I was inspired to make this movie a few years back when I became aware of a court case about a college student who raped a woman who was unconscious behind a dumpster. And as I followed the case, I realized that I was feeling physically sick. I felt like I'd been punched in the stomach. I felt like I wanted to vomit. And sometimes I wanted to just lay on the sidewalk and scream or cry. I started writing this film by journaling. I had all of these thoughts and I just had to furiously write them out on the paper and I started noticing how I react in the world. I started looking at other women and seeing how they reacted to certain things. I noticed, why do I wanna feel like I have to shave my legs? Why do I feel like I need to wear a scented tampon? Why do I have to put makeup on in the morning? Why do women have to race home at night with keys in their hands after work if it's late? Why do women get catcalled on the street? I started getting very, very focused on how I reacted to those things and what it did to me physically and mentally, and I started really notating how it affected other women as well. I started to get really, really curious about how women's bodies move in the world in reaction to patriarchal thinking or misogyny. I didn't want this film to be about just how women navigate the patriarchy. I really wanted to imagine a world where this divine feminine energy gets so strong because of the power of women that it changes us into a whole new way of living. That this collective she is able to transform how we all live. I plan to shoot this film in a way that expresses how something that's going on internally manifests itself outwardly. There will be expressive movement. There will be ways in which we will see how this birthing of a new way of living happens. If anything that I have said to you today inspires you, touches you, makes you angry, makes you want to contribute to some way to female empowerment, um, female support, then I would love for you to donate to this project. 100% of the crew will be female. I want to create my own little mini matriarchy. I want you on my team and I want you to be part of this communion that we're all creating together. Thank you.